data science is something that affects all of our lives in ways that we might not even realise. Even if you've never used a computer, data science is still going to be touching the areas of your life that matter to you most. And those could be things like healthcare, doctors being aided in their decision making by machine learning tools. It could be the way that your local council decides to fill in potholes. One of the hazards that can happen in data science is reinforcing existing bias. And an example of this would be when soap dispensers don't work if you have dark skin. And the reason this happens is because the data that's used to help these machines to work doesn't include a wide range of people. One of the main ways that our project works is bringing together data scientists with people who have expertise in ethics. So those might be philosophers or sociologists. One of the main things that we do is use the labels that we've created and they create conversation between people who have a lot of knowledge in that area and data scientists who might have a lot to learn in that area. The data hazard labels look very similar to Kosh chemical hazard labels. When you see a hazard label on some bleach, that tells you that you shouldn't rub that in your skin, you shouldn't drink it, but it doesn't tell you that you don't want to use bleach for cleaning, it can still be very useful. And that's the same message that we're trying to get across with the data hazard labels. Data science can be very useful, but it's also important to use it safely. At the showcase, we're going to be bringing our hazards with us and having some activities that people can take part in. We're going to have a workshop with some commercial partners who are going to be coming in. Our biggest aim would be to change the culture of data science so that thinking about ethics is a core part of being a data scientist. Data science is too powerful and impactful not to use. It can do too much good in our lives but we need to get a lot better at doing it safely.